stage three. I'm glad you mentioned it, because if not, I was going to get in there. But yeah, this is where he basically made a name for himself and got the eyes, the attention of New Turn. With Flash out around the corner, Kenny going to be looking to pull back. It's actually going to be suggested. Goes down. Blaze King with a nice headshot manages down, to find a second. Go down as Lau finds that kill, but he's quickly traded out. It's flipped. So they'll take in a bit of damage. Spike getting planted again as there's a nice little Spike delay, I believe, planted. from Frostbite. That snake bite. Push around the side. Asterisk looking to spray down too. He will find it. Last just responds in kind. And Uyor goes down as a Lau. They were able to delay it a little bit. Did it enough mattering too much in take. Uh, could be made a little bit easier. Allow still sitting on that Blade Storm. No, Hasn't left. popped it just yet. Been able to get that look there on a Blaze King and all allow. He's just so blind. There's nothing that he could do. They do manage to at least make it a. Gonna be solo creeping into the B site with the spike. He's currently making his way into Hookah, so they're trying to fake this out and likely take the teleporter to join in with him. But Frostbind does manage to catch Gunny off guard. He's now making his way into the site. Still have Blaze hovering nearby. He's making his way back over to B as he does hear that plant going off. Now they're just going to go ahead and rotate through. So you're just trying to see if anybody's going to come out this side. Try to take the TP, but now they have to get over to the site. The defuse is coming in. I don't think you're going to be able to stop this. What in the world happened over here? This is not going so good. It did get stopped just in time. The flash slows up Suggest for a second. Another one as well. And the defuse being held by Flips Jitter. They are going to oh, find man. it. That's going to be the round with out as left. they go ahead and say, okay, we got the lockdown. Now shift over towards... The opposite side. Blaze King, however, waiting just on the other side of this head. Go. He's going to be ready to strike. The drop down stuff in. He gets allowed in the back of the skull. Eeyore is here for the crossfire. And it's going to take two down remaining. with him. Rocket goes Spike out. Down, Shitter beat. absolutely blows up Solo and suggests with a long wraparound. Just now arrives and with no time remaining. He's got to get these kills. Now, this is going to be a tough order for yeah. Suggest, and Low I back. think yeah, he's got to back off and try to save this Vandal. They're going to be an economic dire. Oh, well, wow. Didn't manage to find any value there. Wall's gonna be coming up. New turn making their way out of showers. Snake bite right on the corner, but still a decent amount of space to try to plant. Spike Barry. down. Gonna go down. The snake bite plus the paint shell results in his death. Now the boom bots in. Allow is annihilated and flips jitter. It's just keeping this spike in New Turn's hands. He is not letting them get this down on the ground. It's such a small target area. They know exactly Headshot. the only place that this spike can get planted at. So they know exactly where to aim. Yunny gonna manage to find one on the back end. The utility from the Killjoy is also over there. Right now, a big Ow. push out onto A, or excuse me, B, and Flips Jitter gets parry. Just Not happening. They're completely <laughs> catching New Turn off guard at every twist and turn. From Solo, he'll make it into the shower so he can get some healing before they make their way out onto the site. Suggest, moving forward, making some noise, manages to get a nice headshot. That's the suggest that we're used to seeing. Gets that Ten kill. Ten seconds That's left. Send Eeyore up short. This is going to be yet another B site hit, but it is not. Frostmine left on his lonesome. Will get picked off. Plant oh, right in on the corner, remaining. denying that line of sight away. Spike gets planted moments before Eeyore can get that kill onto Solo, but Lau trades it back. And now it is just Asterisk by himself. It seems like New Turn finally have gotten it done. It's not exactly as clean as they would like. They lose out on two members and potentially a couple more. As Asterisk, Asterisk makes his way forward. A 1v3 scenario. Two Holy members taking a little bit of damage. Goes for the gravity well pulled. Doesn't manage to find it. A couple of blind shots into the box, but chances of being able to turn this around are they've been you know overall quite dominant on this map but it's 61 to 59 percent for their attacker versus their defender side but parry okay he'll just spray through manages to find flip jitter only takes a little bit of damage in that trade back so he'll be very very happy with that Yikes. operator oh, wow. out allow peeking out through showers just gonna tailwind away doesn't want to get sniped there by eeyore I've got your train. Captain the skull on one of the chests, and that would be him on the ground. Play that safe. Goes for the exit. Eeyore in the meantime. Rotated back over through lamps. Makes his way to short. Gets caught by Solo. And it's looking like New Turn should be putting a third online. Spike His planted. asterisk is like, yeah, for the next round a lot. And then kind of on the flip side now, that also Boom is going to have a lot of ults. It's used the good news here for New Turn, even though they're going to lose Solo. Too, but all the same. So. Nice little stock of ultimates that just managed to make that happen. A little bit of a spray through over at short means that Frostmine is down to 62 at the moment. Softening him up and allow gets yet another nice shot. Tailwind's away yeah, just in way. case there's a double peak. We do not see that come through. Now it's going to be a blade storm pot. Voids. Paint shells both updrafts now. Both cloud bursts have been used. Joe Stopper gonna fly out. Oh, it's both of them. Spike down. Huge shot from the side of Flips Jitter making great use. 
Manages to get the two for one special with the rocket. Crossmine still alive. Last HP. He's looking for Solo, who just can't quite steady his aim. It's clipped in the skull by that Vandal. He goes down, and now it's just on Perry, who's just making his way into showers. And in this 1v3, it seems Ten like seconds boom, left. utilizing two of their ultimates Whoa, that were online, on. they have stabilized. Five seconds I remaining. Perry would need to kill both. Kind of being able to see through everything, having a silhouette, even though nobody was there to try to trade that back. He would have been safe. He would have been able to exit. Rolling Thunder at the ready, but Alou goes ahead. Dash his way out on the side. Spots Asterisk, but he manages to trade that out first. Suggest, however, comes Welcome up with two, takes down the Astra, follows up for the race. And now it's going to be Suggest using a Viper's Pit of his own to go ahead and lock down this site, trying to make it impregnable planted. for Boom so that New Turn can get a fourth round here in the half. Yeah, of course, last round of the half, so no reason to not go for this for Boom. Uh, this time around, yeah, Eeyore is going to come in behind uh, Solo. Solo leaves it right as Eeyore comes through. He's got that lockdown. We'll see what kind of position he could maybe get in. It's not going to be wall bangable. Also, might make his way up through elbow, manages to find Perry. Takes a spray in behind him just in case somebody's creeping up through that Goodbye. slight little bit of smoke. But here comes Eeyore. He finds Suggest the smoke's gonna go down. And it's a lockdown right stand. in the center of the point. Frostbite gets done. And now it's just Solo. He hears that a fuse gets started. Push him off in time, gets the kill. Now looks to play this patiently. He knows that he didn't get half. He knows that this is going to explode. Solo will go ahead and get a smoke set up there in the showers. Let's see if anyone's peeking forward. No, they will not. Okay. We're looking to play this out somewhat patiently. Hawk goes out, but with how many nebulas are up, there's no one to blind, but are they going to be prepared? Well, he's, getting, he's creeping forward. Somebody boosted up on top of the box, but they, they actually Spike don't turn down. around, but all of a sudden, three that kills come in for new turn. Frostbind flips. So can have Blaze go down. It's just Eeyore on his left. He'll be able to top up solo. So rotate back now towards the A site. Suggest lurking inside of the poison orb. Hawk goes out and suggests sprays down too. Blitzkin both hitting the floor. He's looking for a little bit more. Right He's gonna find a. it. Gets a third, but Eeyore trades it Ten back. Seconds left. It suggest in the head. That's one, but now on a 2v4 up against a rifle, two specters, and an op. And with no time left, it's just gonna have to be the weapons held in hand here for the side of Boom as they look to survive. Yeah, I think Boom kind of overthinking themselves a little bit on this round. They see that there's not much going on on the B site, and that, I think, maybe made them think that there was a lot of members of New Turn waiting in the wings. Wait, you know, you saw that spray from Flips into Elbow. He didn't get the kill. He darn near, had he got that kill on his solo, that would have been a completely different round. They probably would have pushed into B, taken control of it, got the spike down, and then would have made, you know, New Turn t try to do a 4v5 retake, but instead, uh, no kills, no information garnered on you know, where anybody on new turn was, so they have to rotate with not much time left back over to A, that one-way smoke used so effectively by Suggest there. All right, well, people can breathe easy now. You're in say. And they play to versus Yanni as Perry pushes in the showers, finds a nice headshot. Six rounds was all that new turn was able to get. I was wondering if it was a new turn curse, where as, as long as Hyunny is in the lobby when they're on Vine, six rounds is as many as they're going to be able to win. But it seems like that curse was broken very quickly. Like I said, uncursable, but not unbeatable. New turn, making their way back, pulling over here into elbow. Is Hyunny just playing safe? As Allow will go down, but managed to find a kill first. Man, Flips is just One nuts today here remaining. on Bind, and he's gonna get taken down by Solo. Good crossfire set up between Elbow and the cup there. <laughs> Asterisk not gonna be able to do much after getting stunned up a bit. Hold it down short. Just find one to let the pink shells fly out. So, as they spot one over on the side, but Honey is there to try to support. Man, he's making a one for one. He goes down. Another flash down for the by Perry. Lurking here, has to shoot the Seeker. TP in, suggests, and just to find Eeyore. Comes in to try to help back up. Uh oh, a little bit awkward as that is just Solo getting caught. After shock in hand, goes down, now a 3v3. Now this is, uh, both teams doing good things at the beginning of this round and just barely Boom's able to get a further advantage. Allow's gonna get slowed up, Bladestorm has come out. So the op in the back pack for him for now. Pushing around, needs to clear the right and the left side. Manages to spot one, but flips, just instantly strikes. Gets him in the head with that phantom. Suggest just, just gonna be recovering from the decay, and with two members left, they say, yeah, no, we cannot win this. Let's pull back, hold on to these weapons. 
Maybe try to catch somebody on the exit as Perry lurks just on the outside of Long. Goes for the Last pink command to find Frostmine. Manages to get flips jitter, so makes it a pink. But Operator boosted here on top of Truck for a loud jump board. Flip jitter. There's a funny coming out as he double blast packs for showstopper going to be used. Allow gets a nice shot in on the frost mind. Shitter tagged down, doesn't manage to find anything with the rocket. Now just has 30 HP remaining. He push forward and suggest wins that. Are you joking? He was watching, but he just doesn't manage to get the damage through. Takes him down to 13, so it's still sick. This is gonna be the fault line coming out. Go ahead and hold on to the plant. Shot's not gonna find any kind of connection. A strong new turn. Need to get this retake. So just goes down. HP on him. Not too surprising to see him fall. The rest of the they no longer can afford to lose remaining. out on members. Parry gonna make a kill there on the flip shitter, but then falls to Blaze King. Gets taken down by Hyuni. Now in a 1v2, you are trying to get these headshots in, but Hyuni gets there first. Now gonna be coming through yet again. It's going for the chase on to Parry. Need that back. <laughs> I think it actually managed to connect with him. I think it distorted push. Who's gonna go down as Loud finds the kill? Yanni now has the operator in his hands. Gets rid of Asterisk. And now it's just Eeyore all of a sudden. Just explosion death coming through as kill after kill comes out. Yeah, it's just clearing out over towards Asterisk, but hasn't managed to spot him in solo. Come up with a kill. Push out there from Lamps into short. Gets a close jitter. Yanni will confirm presence. Goes for the Trailblazer spot. The days hard to tell either way. Perry manages to line up. Eeyore then gets rid of back. Blaze King with that sheriff. Remaining. It's a nice headshot through, but unfortunately, it seems to be rather difficult, of course. He's going to throw Lucky down vision. a few stars here, but Suggest is right there. He's just going to push That's through gun in hand. Oh my what? god! Oh my god! <laughs> the swap oh my god. the sheriff he gets a headshot. That is beautiful from Astros. Now he can recover the rifle. Has it in hand, but is he going to be good for the kills? A 1v3, the odds absolutely stacked against him, but my god, what a miracle of biblical proportions it would be if he could pull this off. Bring them within touching distance of new turn yet again. Operator on one side, Hawk goes out, doesn't manage to spot anything. No confirmation of his presence. Pick his angles, figure out where to watch. The fault line goes over into the shower. He tries to push out the back. Time for all of his creeping along. He manages to keep his position completely ambiguous and unknown to the side of New Turn. Gets the jump on Solo. And a cover. See if he's pressing up big time. Eeyore is ready and Eeyore. Sight Seekers confirm his presence here for Hyuni and the rest of New Turn. He will go down. Blaze King finding that kill. Eeyore just looking to make sure that the rotation can't come through Link. Well, I will find a shot on the flips. Eeyore now going to start making his way back over to A to try to defend this spike. New Turn. Still going to be in Amanda's advantage, looking to try to finish off this map. Well, this is going to be tough for a new turn. Allow, you know, they're just not giving any space. Suggest going to get a kill there on a frost mine on the side. Okay, 3v3. Allow with the friends. He has to push in. Their way forward. Nano Swarm comes out. They don't manage to kill it off for the activation. Spot one, one. Allow manages to get one, gets two. Can he get three? Absolutely can. It's four on the round very nicely. It felt like it took him a little while to get going on Bind, but now uh, seems to be further. Actually, Honey, Honey has gone down as we do have the first the attack. Let's see push him up through short here at the site. We'll get taken down as Perry comes in from cross angle. It's that head shot. Well, Frostbind over on the side catches the Lau after he tail with it forward. 38 HP remaining on him. Can he do anything? No. Suggest so is actually going to find him. Finds Eeyore as well. Back-to-back -back headshots. Now we have a 2v2. Well, let's see what they can do. Perry's gonna get one. Suggest well, gets a third on the round, and that didn't take long, Achilleos. <laughs> I know, I know so, your mind, Achilleos. <laughs> so is Charles Foster Kane. He's gotta keep everything protected. Big kills coming out, though. Boom, managed to find four. Just Perry, double bluff going off, but it would have been the correct read. 13 seconds remaining as the spike gets planted. Shots flying out from flips. Manage to connect with Parius. He's just going to sit right here into the nebula. Now pulls away. Is wary about somebody potentially coming in from behind. We'll see that dissipate. Dips back in behind the default box. Both members approach. Link tap on the spike and pair. He has armor. Man stack. Looking out. Looking for the shaman. Oh man, flips is going to be good for it. Still rather strong. It'd be namely when we were, you know, heading over to the maps like Split, where we see the Killjoy coming out from Solo. 
Perry managing to find flips before seconds left. he loses out on his teammate, so another one on the floor. Hyuni gone, no seekers to be used here in this round. 20 seconds remaining, Spike getting inched forward into A. So he pull out from the site there, and Solo trying to creep his way into that A link, gets struck down. Now two members immediately spike hearing the planted. spike plant, they call for reinforcements, and it's a 2v4 in an attempt to try and stave off you want Boom. To fight it. Boom, right now, looking hungry, looking like they might just be able to make this 2-2. Two to two. See if they can get past this wall right now, already one up in heaven. Remaining. Push coming out, Perry, managing to find two. Can he get two more? Goes this out, goes for the push, the crossfires there. Blaze King will get that headshot. No armor, no problem. The fuse will come in. Boom Esports top seeing it, at least at the beginning. Uh, bind instantly tailwind away there from Allow. Can they just play that very cautiously as Solo tries to creep up through the garage? Pistol in hand, you will absolutely dome Blaze King. That's a massive pick. Wow. I mean, just wow. Ooh. I think one knife hit there on a the parry. Yeah. Right back a little bit of damage, but that's going to be parry. Knocked down to 75. And Solo comes up with yet another headshot. This time, Obscuring the vision. Sheriff same round. Looking pretty darn good. That will be the stun coming out onto Asterisk as well. Lockdown going to be used here on the C site. Well, moving up and allow oh, instantly domes him with the blade storm. Suggest he's going to deny that away. Not gonna let, get, let allow get that second kill. And just like that, this is looking like a wonderful thrifty from New Turn. Well, there's so much that goes right for New Turn in this round, and, and I mean, obviously, the solo shot suggests Harry. You know, the old school tax shooter players. Whoa, okay, well, allow thought about getting aggressive. Flip sider, oh, he's good in there too. That's two for him. Managed yeah, to find two, but as the blinds come in, Solo will strike back. Makes it a two for two exchange. See where they want to try to take this. First mind trying to watch the cross, but Johnny will manage to strike him down. So just like that, we're now at a two to two. Yeah. Yours position noted. Wow. Asterisk as well, not able to get anything going around that corner. The uh, reaction time. Oh, just allows. incredible. Yeah, it pushes out of the smoke. Asterisk, he can't even get a shot off. He doesn't even really connect with the Lao. He's that already knocked down to 33 HP. Gunny gets a little bit of a read here that Eeyore was going to be creeping up through short, but he doesn't manage to win out on the exchange. So this does leave Lao now in a 1v1. The lockdown's going to be used. Lao, see where he wants to try to push this. He might just take the fight to him. Try to get this destroyed. He's tucked away into the corner. Bots it out. Tries to get the destroy. Lao, though, he's going to be locked down. And here comes the kill. Can't make it out. Asterisk will scoop that one up. It was a nice attempt from Allow. He thought he had just enough clearance on the lockdown to destroy it. He did not. That Frostbind only going to have the Sheriff behind her. I don't think he heard it. Side. I don't think Solo has any awareness of this, though. I don't think he knows to really look at it. Oh, the timing comes through. He actually threw the vision. Oh, line as he's trying to recover. Let's get taken down by Hyunny. Pushes into the backside, finds Blaze King, and just like that, the advantage is back in the hands of Nutri. The Seeker's planted. moving out, but they know very Last well that everybody is at. I mean, find a third kill as the Seeker is just leading Frostbind forward. Scoop up the Phantom, we'll see if he can get anything done here. Goes for the peak, doesn't see anything, but two going to be tucked away inside of the cubby. Gravity well, pulling on him just a bit, gets that dink, just, like just now down to 2 HP. Frostbind probably wishes that he played something that had a grenade. Wants to try to go for that push, but Blind will stop him up. Just drawing out even more time. Well, Blind not going to connect. Gets a headshot on the parry. Oh, Blaze. Right here from the window. He's trying to look for the headshot. He will get solo. Public Divide goes out. Lear through the wall. Push comes in. Blaze King looking to get on top of him. Manages to find one. Takes a dismiss. Frostbind finds the other. As Yunny goes down. Wild spray th out through the nebula. And suddenly hitches two members remaining. Looking aftershock but they see the push coming in oh, yeah, yeah. shut down on the blaze king aftershock goes out but flip shooter shuts down suggest who's coming in that will be the close out on the round boom looking up flips now looking over towards c long there's a couple members here he's he's ready. Ready. Perry's not even looking in that direction he's trying to set up stars and blaze king again at the start of the round finds a massive value comes up with two kills this time around allow however out onto the site and behind managed to find flip shitter blaze king be tucked away on that right side for now. Spike's been moved up in the hands of Solo. 
They want to clear this angle before they go for the plan. Knives gonna whiff. Blaze King Mo's down two more. Gets four in the round. Solo strikes him down, but now finds himself in a 1v2 scenario. Needs to come out on top, but lurking out from mid through window is Eeyore, and he's going to be ready for the crossfire, I think. Or no, he's actually going to let Solo run past. Oh, he could have gotten like Solo done to right. Okay. Doesn't matter. Bit to be desired. And a couple wins on it after Reykjavik, but here we go. Fast to start allow. Gets a headshot there on the flip shitter. Ice King trying to turn it back with that frenzy. will put a decent amount of damage into the enemy jet, but let's get taken down. Heals come out from Hyunny. The rest of Boom now make their way through over towards B. Solo on the lurk right here at the C link. Pulls back in the garage. Well, Frostbind taken down off screen. Right click from Eeyore finds a good chunk of damage. On the Solo, he's looking to finish the job, and Solo gets him with the headshot. Asterisk will fall. Boom, will at least be great. Well, it's just going to be a steady push up. See Long. They go out. Carry the back side. Allow Tux into the corner with Spectre. Manages the bow down too. Swaps over the ghost. One Short little tailwind, but he'll take one into the corner and suggest that they're for some covering C. fire. So Carry will go down, but that's the only casualty they suffer. They have the spike down in sight, and it's just Eeyore out at sea long. Well, that might have been the straw that broke the camel's back here. Allow going to find his third at long range. Snipe onto Blaze. And we'll pull back. Playing this out conservatively. They might not be ready for Flips, who's got himself moved way up on long. That's what I was And I don't think, I don't know if that Hawk caught him. Flips gets one, dashes right back. Oh, but the right. spring comes in. They managed to find the kills. And this oh is a massive God. turnaround. This is exactly what Boom will be the oldest, the most seasoned veteran that we have in this lobby right now. But Spike that planted. means that he is uh, pretty wise to not take this fight head on. We'll see if he can get caught off guard, but he actually manages to spot Eeyore first. And he also trying to take this fight. Has a Vandal in his hands. We know how deadly he can be with that, so they're going to look to try to just dome somebody, take him out of the fight. Allow him to up around the side. Spots out on the... Oh, the turret. And then he lines up a beautiful headshot onto Eeyore, but they know that this is going to be an overextension if they try to recover that rifle, so they will just go ahead and pull back. It's good restraint being shown by New Turn. Yeah. Oh, nice flick from Flips. Makes it out a 4v4. Absolutely filthy, absolutely filthy, Achilles. Let's see what they can do on this potential retake. Suggest is gonna get Flips after the flash. That's why you give him the Vandal. One enemy remaining. Oh, and it's just a fine two. Great value being found, and he's gonna be very grateful for that purchase. Nice little headshot again with the Sheriff from Allow. Two for him in the round. Guns recovered. Op is on the floor. And Blaze King. He seems to be undetected, at least for now, but with this crossfire setup, making it through this archway, killing both would be nigh impossible. He'll, get, he'll be good for a couple ultimates online as well. Boom, need to dig deep right here, right now. Yeah, I, I don't know what you can do against stuff like what Allow does. I thought that's really well played there by Eeyore. He anticipates the aggression. He's ready for it. Absolutely so filthy when he's dialed in with it. <laughs> Allow comes out on top. I've got gets the body trying. shot on the flips. Puts him on the floor and things just became that much more difficult for the side of Boom. Solo, however, gonna be gone. Blaze King, he used the dismiss, however. Mm. And he's got the healing from this guy to try to top him back up. Obviously not gonna have any overhealing right now, so he's without shields. They level the playing field just a bit. They're still in a very precarious spot, Perry, waiting just on the other side of this exit out of the garage. Oh, Perry. Oh, no. Ooh! Push it. Oh. It's the shot. Oh. Frostmine cannot answer back, Perry. Good for two, and suddenly there's just two members left. Nebula gonna be used. Covers the operator. Asterisk gonna be looking to try to out duel against Allow. Shot flies out. It does not connect, so Allow's gonna look to reposition. Says, go ahead, come at me. Come at me. I hope you, you creep run. your way up here towards C. But now, Allow's gotta be worried about this flank and that lockdown that's been placed inside a garage. Well, he thought about trying to go for that left. long C peak off of it and opts to just get the heck out of it instead. Eeyore is pushing around the edges, seeing if anybody's going to get caught. Nobody is detained, so sight is open. Nano Swarm is going to be placed at the alley entrance, and that's the only direction right now that New Turn has available to them. And New, uh, Eeyore here going to get the information that nobody's in window. The Rolling Thunder is going to come through. Let's go out, Eeyore, looking to creep around the back. Flash points flying Last through. Astros pulls standing. his way back into the garage, but he can't manage to get Hyunny. He takes him down to 18 HP, but that is not going to be good enough. It needs to be a big play from Eeyore, but he's not going to find it.